So Christmas in the Air is just an event that we do uh, annually every year. It's been going on for quite a few years and it's just a way for us to give back to the community and say thank you for being here. So what it is is we take a Saturday in December, so this year December 7th uh, from 10 to 3 where we invite everybody to come in kind of open house style, enjoy uh, what EAA has to offer, going through the museum, seeing a lot of our artifacts, our aircraft, as well as some additional activities that we have going on from writing letters to Santa um, to having cookies and milk to seeing different performances from area groups whether it's musical or dance groups or choral groups um, just having a good time and enjoying the, the festivities. It really is encompassing in the entire museum. Um, we have different exhibits that are going to have certain activities going on um, throughout. We actually have different performances from the minute you walk into the museum lobby all the way through the museum to the other side uh, in the Eagle Hangar. So we have uh, Julie's Touch of Silver that's here doing a big dance performance. Santa arrives via helicopter at noon so you can just come outside and see him arrive, weather permitting of course. Um, and then he's going to do a tree lighting ceremony and you can get your photo with Santa that day once he arrives via helicopter. So lots of different things going on all throughout the museum, not in one location. We'll have signage to get you where you need to be. There will be programs available showing you the performance schedule so you really can just come in and have a wonderful time. If you've never been here, not only get to you just enjoy the holidays being here, um, it's all decked out for, for Christmas and you have areas where you can take photos and maybe you want that Christmas card photo and you haven't got that yet, definitely come out to the museum and that's something that you can do. Um, but we have things going on all the time, but this is a, at least a, a time where you get to come for free. We open up the museum to the community to allow you to come in and just enjoy, enjoy what you have. And it's our way of, of saying thank you and supporting us over the years. Um, we do ask, you know, if, if you can do a donation to Toys for Tots, we do have a toy drive running, um, so unwrapped toys or non-perishable food items that you can bring that go to the Oshkosh Food Pantry um, are certainly appreciated. But that but otherwise it's a free event. If you've attended the event in the past, we are changing things up a little bit um, as far as the location of different activities. So it's good to grab a program uh, right when you walk in since we will have moved things around a little bit. Um, but yeah, having Santa arrive via helicopter going into our Eagle hangar this year, um, kind of having him immersed with more aircraft than we've had in the past. So it'll be a cool sight to see. Um, but there's just definitely things going on. We can't thank our sponsors enough. Uh, Bake First National, Grant Thornton, uh, Tamra's, our media sponsors. Ascension is going to be doing face painting this year so definitely an opportunity for the kids to come out and get their face painted so lots to see, lots to do. You'll have a wonderful time. EAA is hosting their Christmas the Year again on December 7th from 10 a.m. to 3 out at the Aviation Museum. We hope to see you guys all there. It'll be a good time. Oshkosh Today was supported in part by the Friends of OCM. Aurora Healthcare, 855 Northwest Haven Drive and House of Flowers, 1920 Algoma Boulevard.